Shalom Aleichem, everybody. Hope all is well. We are less than four days before the Holy Jewish New Year, Rosh Hashanah. And now is really the time to do a deep reflection on our previous year and on our deeds and where we're standing and holding in our relationship with God Almighty. Now is the absolute time to focus deeply on this reality. My friends, there is a big promise that Hashem has made to us, a promise to redeem us and send the Mashiach. And we are in this final generation, as the Rebbe said. The Mashiach's coming will be marked by the building of the temple. The third temple will be built, and the temple will facilitate a revelation of Hashem throughout the entire world. It's not just a very beautiful building, which it is. It's not just a fancy place that shows our victory, which it also does. But it shows on a much deeper note, it will change the setting of the world, the mode. It will flip the switch that the mode of the world, the setting of the world will change to a godly reality. Where God's light will shine within the world in a revealed and internalized way. Hashem's infinite light will shine in the world. When a person lives in this world, when they pass away, they go up to Gan Eden, to heaven. Their soul goes up to the Garden of Eden and experiences a revelation of God based on the deeds they did in this world. Which is an infinite pleasure, compared of no comparison to any pleasure we've ever felt in this world before. Your greatest moment in life is of no comparison, is not even in the same discussion as what goes on in even the lowest level of Gan Eden, the Garden of Eden. But those levels, as great as they are, are nothing compared to what will take place here in this physical world when the Messiah comes. Because this physical world, yes, it's physical, is the ultimate purpose. Even though it's the lowest at first glance of all the worlds, it is the ultimate purpose, and it will become the highest world when Mashiach comes. Where every pleasure combined is nothing compared to even the smallest second in the Messianic era. Guys, let's get ready. Let's take this into our hearts. Every good deed we do, every law we learn, builds the temple and brings us closer. 